In this week's fact session, I sit down with MLG Zone Slasher and JP McDaniel to get their insight and answers to what's on your mind. What's up, guys? Welcome to Frequently Asked Questions, MLG's new question and answer show. I'm Chris Bucket. Joined today by not Sundance, I got Slasher sitting in Sundance's seat, and we got JP back behind us. JP joining us all the way from Texas. What's up, JP? It is going good, man. How's it up there in New York? Oh, it's kind of warm and beautiful. You guys ready to uh, answer some questions? Let's now, as go. always, we've asked you, the community, to send in your questions to us at, at MLGFact on Twitter. And now it's time to go through it, starting with our first question. What's going on with Dota, guys? What can we expect to see out of that game in the next year? I mean, this weekend, uh, Dota 2 first reveal of the game itself. We haven't seen it. We saw, like, one screenshot of the minimap. It looks really good. Um, from everyone who I've heard from, from the event itself, it plays real well. All the Dota players are pleased. The Heroes and Europe players are pretty pleased. The League of Legends players even re really like it. Um, and I heard like a million and a half people were watching it on the first day, which is unbelievable. So I only see it uh, getting better and better and growing bigger and bigger because Dota was the foundation of the entire MOBA kind of genre to begin with. So having the first succession of Dota from Dota 2, as we saw with StarCraft and StarCraft 2, it can only get so much bigger. Will more Koreans be invited for StarCraft 2? Will, will there be more of an effort to invite equal numbers of the three StarCraft 2 races? First of all, I think um, for this season, we have the exchange program with the GSL, where each event, we send four guys, they send four guys. Um, so I think for at least this year, we're not gonna be bringing over more than four, but I do expect to see more Koreans come. We had nine back at Anaheim. But uh, let's talk about the races here, guys. I guess a lot of people were frustrated to see how many Terrans we had at the last event. Um, JP, you're kind of on the inside of that whole process. Talk to us about how we select the players. Well, just first and foremost, right now over in Korea, Terran's probably the most played race in the competitive scene. Uh, a lot of the Protosses really aren't the tip top players over there. And I'm not citing that Protoss is the weakest race or anything like that. It's just, that's how it is. Uh, we, we try to kind of split up the different races, uh, the Terran, the Zerg, and the Toss. But when you have four players, it's always going to be biased for at least one race. So really can't have a, a perfect split there. Uh, but at the same time, we do try to figure out uh, if we can invite one Zerg, one Protoss, and one Terran each time. Um, however, a lot of times it comes down to their schedules and not ours. So we kind of have to be at the, at the will of the players. And if they can actually come over, then we'll be happy to have them. But sometimes you got to just kind of roll with the cards that you're dealt. All right, this next question is uh, a lot of the Hill guys are asking me, is there any team that can take down Instinct right now? Since forming back for Columbus, Instinct is a 42-1 and one in individual games. A ridiculous record. They're basically the brand new dynasty in Halo. Um, but if I was going to pick a team that could take them down, I just did this in a Dream Team thread. It's three members of Dynasty. So I think Dynasty is going to be the key squad in Raleigh. That's the only team, in my opinion, that has a chance of taking them down. Slasher, I know you get to watch a little bit of the Halo. Do you have any other top teams that could take them out? I'm taking old school Final Boss Team 3D for the win. Old school. Old school. So I'm taking 2006 Final himself? Boss. Yep. All right, I could see that. I got it. Yeah, one day. Uh, so the answer really there, no. No one's going to be instinct this next event. But if anyone does, it's going to be Dynasty. That is going to do it for episode two of Frequently Asked Questions. Slasher, JP, thank you guys for joining us. Thank you. And we will see you guys in a couple weeks right here on MajorLeagueGaming.com.